So hey everyone, I'm Suzanne, I'm the founder of the International HSP Center and um, I use my voice for our highly sensitive men in the world, our highly sensitive children in education who are often not seen, heard and understood. And I help adults uh, exploring their why, um, living their purpose and creating their legacy. So in short, that means uh, personal growth for adults in education and entrepreneurship. So today I want to uh, open up a dialogue. And um, a dialogue, so it means respectful. Everybody can share their opinion, but it needs to be respectful. And uh, it's something that I, um, that I came across uh, on social media. And it is a statement, or you could say a quote. And um, it says, protect your daughters. And then it's uh, crossed out or um, a line in between. And then it says, educate your sons. So I'm really inquisitive how our highly sensitive men here and our parents in this group um, are... Uh, how that feels for them because to me having two sons and working with uh, many HSP men uh, it feels like a huge insult so if it feels like that to me <laughs> how does that feel to you and that's why I want to open up this dialogue because there are many things going on on social media that are sometimes uh, it feels like bashing men and I can understand that when you're especially when you're a highly sensitive man that and when you process things more deeply, it can uh, feel like, uh, yeah, sometimes like maybe an attack, uh, um, like an insult. So, protect your daughters, educate your sons. How does that feel? Um, first of all, uh, I will express my, <laughs> my insight. Um, it's... Why do you have to educate? Don't men know that by nature? That's uh, something that I, uh, I, I really wonder why that should be said. Um, I understand that sometimes uh, women, of course, have uh, experienced, well, less joyful experiences, but also men. And that's what we often forget. They're also... Not only women are abused, also men. And that's what that, something that we don't often speak about. And often also abused by women. So I'm opening up something here. <laughs> and I hope you join the dialogue. Uh, you can uh, also respond later, of course. Um, because it's also for women. When you grow up with these statements... As a uh, young girl, it might feel scary to interact with men. Uh, or you might create a different mindset than you would otherwise have uh, interacting with men or, um, yes, approaching men. So it's something that I think should be addressed. And also it puts women in a victim uh, position, a victimhood. Protect your daughters. I understand that. <laughs> but I also think that when we uh, share this so often, isn't it also great to add something like, and you also need to protect, learn to protect yourself. So I was just wondering... How does that feel to you? I can't see any comments. I do see that some people are watching. Um, so in a way, I think that's harming uh, men uh, because I think that men are often not acknowledged for who they actually are. Uh, I'm speaking um, for men in general. And... Uh, not only the highly sensitive men here, <laughs> of course, <laughs> you understand. Uh, for men in general, um, 
and maybe you have encountered s statements in social media as a man that that hurt that uh, that might feel so misaligned with who you are with your values um, and I think that men can raise their voice even more about these things um, because I understand that there is a macho image created and I know for sure that so many men don't agree with that and uh, even uh, the men who fall into the category they think they fall into the category <laughs> um, but I would really like to know how you feel about that and um, of course we opened this up uh, during the global high sensitive men's summit um, but I also see and notice that men open up uh, more in private and I think that's great um, and we also need uh, more men who raise their voices to speak up uh, for men in general so how does it feel how does it affect your body um, uh, let me know in the comments below i'm curious uh, what in internal process uh, it not only internal, it's so much more. It, I think it also affects your life, uh, the way you act. The may, sometimes you might be more cautious than you would normally be. So let me know in the comments below uh, if you want to join the next Maverick event uh, for sensitive men and you want the details, just send me a message. And uh, have a wonderful day. Bye bye.